World AIDS Day arrives at a defining moment. AIDS-related deaths have fallen by almost 70% since their peak in 2004, and new HIV infections are at the lowest point since the 80s. But AIDS still takes a life every minute. We can and must end AIDS as a public health threat by 2030. Reaching this goal means heeding this year's theme, let communities lead. The past to ending AIDS runs through communities, from connecting people to the treatment, services and support they need, to the grassroots activism pushing for action so all people can realize their right to health. Supporting those on the front lines of the battle against AIDS is how we win. That means placing community leadership at the center of HIV plans, programs, budgets and monitoring efforts. We must also remove barriers to community leadership and ensure space for local civil society groups to take forward their vital work. Above all, we need funding. The AIDS response is low and middle in, in low and middle income countries needs over $8 billion more per year to be fully funded. This must include scaled up funding for local programs led by people living with HIV and preven prevention initiatives led by communities. AIDS is beatable. Let's finish the job by supporting communities to end this scourge in their neighborhoods, their countries and around the world.